Welcome everyone, GamerCop here. This is episode 17 of Satisfactory. So I apologize, no fishing North Atlantic this week. Um, it's been mostly Satisfactory episodes actually, and that's just because they've been a little bit easier for me to put together as far as time, because we've just been trying to get stuff done and get stuff built up around our new factory. Um, so I do apologize about that. Next week we'll hopefully have two fishing North Atlantic, at least one. Uh, but yeah, it just takes me a little bit more time to put those together, and I've just kind of run out of time this week, but um, I think our next production we need to get added in here, which this is going to be a building episode primarily. I think our next thing we need to add in is going to be rotor production. So if that is what we're going to shoot for next, which I think we can do right next to this guy. Um, but we are going to have to extend the factory out a little bit. So we can just do the top floor while we're up here. Um, I know it's going to go out over that a little bit, but that should be fine. Eventually we'll have explosives and stuff to be able to remove some of those. Let's go four out to start, because I think that'll be a good way to get us going. There we go. All right. So... Um, yeah, I think it's gonna go right next to this guy and then come down this hole here. So we have enough to build a constructor Oop, We need some uh, reinforced iron plates. Let's go get some of those guys but Yeah, I think we'll put it up there and then we can kind of drop it down here Because um, if we go into our Parts menu here we got everything up to if we get rotors done then the next things we got is smart plating and then quite honestly steel um, which will probably do steel production first um, probably get that going because we really want to get that going I'd, I'd like to get some of that going in this episode if we can as well uh, just because I think that's just what we need to get going honestly um, yeah there we go okay perfect Stuff is slowly getting moved over here. Oh, that's a constructor. We need an assembler. Ah, oh, jeez. Damn, how many rotors? <laughs> I wasn't prepared for that. I was looking at the wrong thing. That's okay. We'll hop back down here. Okay, do I have any rotors in here? Where did I put all my rotors? I mean, I know I don't have any rotor production over here. Gosh, they might all be back at the other base. Yeah, I think they are. All right, well, we'll go back up there. We'll grab some rotors. Yeah, that's what we'll do. We're making progress. Some of these conveyor belts out here that kind of move resources around, we'll probably end up organizing them into one structure at some point it's just right now i'm not too worried about that as long as we got the production going uh, we can always change it up later and make it a little bit more organized which we will do at some point ah there's all my valuable stuff and actually this we can get rid of um okay everything's going good out here actually we can probably get rid of this guy too since we're getting ready to set this up do you have anything? No rotors, but we'll grab that stuff from you. Oh, there we go. All right. This is getting hard plates. We might as well grab some of these while we're here. Um, but yeah, that's that's going strong. I'm actually gonna go since we have that getting produced at the other factory. This producing, yeah, it's producing just screws for it. Let's get. Uh, the miner that's powering these guys, let's just turn it off for now so it can start kind of wrapping up its production. And then we'll let them keep going. And actually, since it's doing what it's doing right now, let's go ahead and, since we got one of these, let's go ahead and get this going a little bit quicker even. Actually, iron plates is the one that's, that's slowing down the process. Let's get, uh, and it's just because they don't have any of those. <laughs> coming in slow okay i don't think we can really speed it up a whole lot unless we overclock everything so i'm not gonna worry about that 
But that way that can start just kind of slowing down its production. Over here we probably got a lot of extra junk going on. That's moving stuff into here. Um, or let's put six of these into the recycler. Six uh, spools of 500 wire because we're getting plenty produced at the new factory. <laughs> Plus we have all that there. So uh, we'll just put six in for now and that can start processing through into coupons for us. So we can start buying more stuff eventually. Yeah, I'll just start getting rid of some of the junk we're not going to use ever. Slow but sure, we're making progress on here. I wish this guy would run a little bit faster, but... Oh well, that's okay. Alright, let's put... One, two, three, four, five, six in there. We just sort our stuff. There we go. Um, I want you up there, though. Okay, beautiful. We're going to start, start spitting those into there. Yep, slowly working it down. Yeah, it doesn't really matter as far as point-wise, but again, it's going to be 500 times each of those point levels for each of those spools, so good to go there. Okay, let's get back upstairs, and let's get... Uh, production go on again oops the stairs are over here well stairs i say but the ramp whatever our ability is to get to the next next level now, i think we can run this guy off of what we have going on here let's do assembler okay, a little bit of space Okay, so we're essentially trying to build rotors, so we need to get rods and screws here. So half of the rods that are on this honestly could go there, and that would be fine. Because that thing is producing a ton of rods. So that honestly could just get split down here. get that put in the way we should get it in um are these uh that's an mk1 is that an mk1 as well yeah okay let's keep doing mk1s then we'll bring you down to right about maybe we actually we should put this this is splitter here yeah okay let's get this in first Let's put one on top of that so we can have it just a little bit raised. There we go. Grab that, connect that to there. Connect one into there. It actually doesn't look half bad, I'm okay with that. Connect one into there. Okay, so there's rods. So the second thing we need to get is screws, which how is this doing on screws? Screws are a limiter for it, so we honestly need... We need more screws. More screw production. Rods are getting there, and yeah, these rods are going to get filled up fast. So we're getting so many rods out of this. Let's go ahead and put in a constructor here. I think that'll work fine there. And if we can get this to there and this to there, we can use a third of the screws or all the extras to make screws. So I think that'll work fine for us. Uh, okay, now we got to get powered all this stuff. Yeah, that's got three out of four on it. We'll run that guy to here and then run another one to, I think, just over here would be fine. And that guy can power that. This guy can power this. And that should be everything. And then you're now making rotors. You're making screws, which will get pumped into there. Okay, I think that's a good setup for that. Um, and we're maximizing what we got going on. Now we just got to get a down 
conveyor belt from here. So let's get um, because the down conveyor belts really hate me. That should no, that's gonna be too close. One further back from that. Let me get on this side of it. it. Might be a little bit more helpful. I think right there is perfect. Yes, that's perfect. Okay. Let's put this into there. Make sure that's as high as the other one. Beautiful. Two. Well, actually, this doesn't matter. That's not going to be connected there. Let's get this one connected up. So this is going to go... Rotors are going to go to this guy right here. So let's get him connected up. And worked across. Heck, this will be the rotor one. Hmm. Yeah, that's probably okay. I think I can live with that. Yep, straight across there. Okay. Beautiful. And right to there. Okay, awesome. Now, if we go up to the next floor, we should be able to get that now going the way it should. And that will be awesome. And we have a lot of... How many more spaces do we have down there? So steel can probably go into a lot of those ones down there. Get our steel production going that way. But so far, we're keeping it pretty organized. I think this is going to turn out to be a pretty good setup for us. But honestly, this is that's the rotors done. Now we just got to get steel going. All right, let's grab this guy. You are going to go from there to there. Oops. And how are you keeping up with materials? You're actually doing decent. Those are getting produced fairly quick. Which is great. And the rods are coming in just fine, so... Now this thing is starting to get taxed a little bit on the rods, but there's plenty there. So this guy's not getting affected by rods, and then you also have a hundred in there. Yeah, I think maybe just to get it boosted, let's get that in there to get it going again. But yeah, half our rods are coming down this way. I think it will be fine at the end of the day. We'll put a hundred in there as well, just to give it a little bit of a boost. Yeah, I think it'll be fine at the end of the day, because... Fairly quickly, this one here is going to fill up. And once this one is full, then it's not going to send any more this way. It's just going to send them splitting to those two there. But there's a lot of rods, and now there's not as many. But that's okay. It's making use of them. It's doing what it's supposed to be doing. So we'll just hope for the best, and it's going to just produce rotors and what we need. And we shouldn't need too many of those types of things right now. Um, but yeah. Okay. Uh, fabulous. Let's get some steel production going. So... Uh, if we go to parts. Yeah, three iron ore, three coal. And that just gets made out of the beams, and those just get made out of the... Or the ingots. Those just get made out of the ingots. So, yeah, I think we can get those pretty easily. Um, there's the foundry. That's what we need to produce it. So we need um, probably, I'd say, two foundries, and then... Actually, just two constructors, really. Um, yeah, okay. So we just need to get those resources. We just need some modular frames, honestly, at this point. Um, I'm Part of me is tempted to put steel on the next floor. Let's see how far we can go down below with our construction down here. Yeah, because this is just going to run into those pretty quick. Which isn't the end of the world. We honestly could cover some of it up, but... I don't want to keep going out that way for... Ugh, yeah. I don't know. This doesn't need to be here anymore. Yeah. We also could go further back on it if we wanted to, but I think we need to go up a level, quite honestly. How much uh, resources do we have? Plenty of that. We probably need some more cement. Do we have any cement in here? One cement. 
Um, we actually probably can grab just those basic amounts of those products there. A little bit of those. Plenty of cement in here. Okay. That should be enough to go up another level. Which we need to expand this out too if we're going to go up another level. Oop. Actually, that doesn't need to be there. Because this is just going to go up. So if we build the ramp, well, it actually would need that there, that there, that there. And then we can build these guys. And that will be the next level, theoretically. I don't think it's going to go above those, though. So I think we are going to have to go up another, maybe make that four below us. Oop. Where did I put that? Let's get rid of that. I think that floor below us is going to have to be four high just to make sure we're clearing everything in here. Yeah, so those have to be both ramps. Actually, that doesn't have to be there. But this guy will have to be... Put that there. Maybe. There we go. Okay. First, let's make sure this is actually going to work. By going above our factories over here. Yep. That will work just fine. Okay. I know it is a bit crazy to have steel this high up in the air, but I think this will be the last level of the factory, and then we'll close it off. Get all these built up real quick. So many. <laughs> Lots of walls to build now, too. <laughs> that might be some stuff I get done off camera. But uh, yeah, with lots of... Because this top floor here is probably going to have to be four high as well. Oh, that was bad. That's okay. We, we did okay on that. I thought we were going to get injured off of that. So yeah, that doesn't look too bad up there, I think. Um, let's actually, while we're down a level, let's go downstairs and get our um, modular frames. Since we are going to need those. I don't know how many we'll have here. Ooh, 36. Yep, plenty of those here. Which is great. That means our production is actually doing fairly well at producing what it needs to, um, even at a slow rate. So that is good news for us. Yeah, this thing is gonna look a little bit weird at first, but that's okay. <laughs> It'll look like just like a big orange structure once we actually get a lot of the stuff built up in it. And a lot of it, once we get the top floors and stuff done, we won't, we won't really have to touch it all. Once it's set up, it just needs to keep producing unless we want to adjust it to produce different things, but. Oh, I jumped off again. Jeez Louise, I keep doing that. That time I did take some damage. That's okay, let's run back over there. 
Gotta stop jumping off if I can. And once again, this guy just needs to be able to run faster. <laughs> All right, here we go. Making progress, almost done. Alright. Alright, beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, this is really high up. Yeah, this is very high up. <laughs> it's been a little tricky to get everything in here, but uh, I think it'll work out just fine. Um, okay, so... Here's... Ooh, there's where the ramp's at. So let's put a wall here to kind of help denote where it's at. Is that the outside side? Yep, that is. Okay. There we go. Just so we can kind of see where the the edge is here. And the back. Okay. The other thing we'll have to run up here is power. So if we get, um, how many connections does that have? Or any of these have? That one's only got three out of four, so we'll run off of that one. I'm just going to do it like this because I think it'll look nicer. Even if it's not really necessary per se. Okay. We have power up here. Now, um, this way we need to build production, a foundry. So we'll get probably one in here. There we go. And we need a second foundry. Get lined up with that one. So probably one two, three, four over. Then we honestly just need constructors, which we could probably line up pretty easily with that. There we go, okay. Because you guys can produce the beams, right? Yep, you'll do pipes and then you'll produce beams. Okay, and you guys are gonna produce steel and you're gonna produce steel. Okay, let's put some of this stuff together here. Beautiful, now we just have to truck in the uh, pole and the iron, so, which is easier said than done. Honestly, we might use, we might come in right over here maybe. Maybe right below, ah, uh, those things got, oh, they're taking up all that wall space down there. Maybe if we use, yeah, this wall's free right here. If we use a, let's do walls. Got the inside one, yep, okay. And then if we used a two conveyor, yep, from that side. And so this time our little elevators, which we are gonna use elevators this time, um, they are actually gonna work for us because we're trying to raise them up um, so that should be a lot better for us, I think. All right, what do you got in your inventory here? Let's go ahead and stop this from happening for a second. Um, actually, yeah, we'll probably just grab all that because this got to get destroyed to get out of our way. Because right there we're going up. So let's get, we have an MK2. We probably want to use an MK2. Uh, we probably should just put in a foundation to kind of give it something to snap to here. Okay. Okay, two in. 
Uh, oop, not a lookout tower. There we go. Um, okay. How high does that need to be? Looks like right about there. Okay. And this guy. Um, is that going to work? Nope, you need to be over one more. Let's get him, see if I can't get back a little bit further. On to about the same height. Well, it needs to be exactly the same height. There we go, that should work. Okay, that I'm hoping is going to work at the top end of that. Let's make sure real quick, though. Run up there. Yeah, well, eventually we'll get like some hyper tubes kind of stuff set up to help us out, but we need to get some steel production rolling before we can do that. Oh, and those aren't quite right, but can they go through there? No, they can't. Oh, they're not quite right. Darn it. Okay, let's try to do it from up here then. Um, oh, there we go. Maybe do it a little bit further out. Might be smarter. Nope, that wasn't right. Okay, that's right. That looks right. That should work just fine. Why are you not connecting to that? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, there it was. There it is. Okay. So just a bit tricky to get that to hook up. All right. So now let's go get an MK2 set up here. There we go. Here in line with that guy. I think that's where the other one is. Or is that? Nope, that's one too high. Darn it. Okay. Get this set up then. Right there. That should be fine. Oh, almost had it. Oh, come on. There we go. Okay. Beautiful. <laughs> and those guys are need to be split in here. They probably should put some splitters here. Seven splitters. Yep. Okay. So coming from that end. Okay, or you can go to the top one, you can go to the bottom one. There we go. Am I going in there actually? Yeah, okay. Well, that part worked out really well, so there we go. Okay, now we just gotta run Look at my time here. I'm starting to run out of time to record. <laughs> um, okay. So. Oop, whoops. I think on that note, we're going to go ahead and wrap it up. We made some good progress, I think. Um, so next episode, we will start getting some more steel production going and get it actually going. Um, but yeah, we got a third floor added on, which is pretty incredible as it is. Let's see if I can get a good screenshot of this. This time I normally do my screenshots, by the way, for like thumbnails and stuff. Climb up one of these guys, since these guys aren't really that expensive to build. And you can just destroy stuff in this game anyways. And then go into photo mode. Zoom in. I think this one will be something about a third level. There we go. That's how I do it. But anyhow, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video, drop a like down below. If you haven't already, hit that subscribe button up on the screen to join the Gamer Cop channel. And turn on your notification bell so you don't miss any future videos I may post. This has been GamerCop. Thank you guys for coming and watching.